Hey, you know what, Tanya, a couple minutes ago, it was people everywhere. Now, as you look across this parking lot, all you see are the cars, <laughs> except for these folks that just made a mad dash. People not wanting to get soaked out here. Inside the stores, stuck as they try to get those last minute shopping supplies and gifts that they need. Gray skies and the whipping wind would be enough to make Mara Husong get moving. Tornadoes are a whole other ball game in December. One last big trip to Kohl's, then off for groceries. I guess we'll head to Kroger now and get in line with everybody else. She would not be wrong. We're told it was wilder than usual two days before Christmas at the Harper's Point Kroger. We're just now getting food for our party tonight and for our Christmas Eve dinner tomorrow. Okay. And I wish I would have came yesterday. I got your sticker. Lauren Josefo scrambling to get the kids snacks for the road trip south. Hearing about all the rain that's coming, we wanted to get to the stores early. That didn't do these folks much good in a line wrapped around the Fields Ertel Honey Baked Ham. You're going to try to get home before this weather hits? Oh, yeah. Yeah, most definitely. If the line keeps moving, <laughs> that'd be great. Yeah. Just down the road, a sign that says it all. Here's hoping El Nino doesn't steal your Christmas. Ah, yes. Yeah. So the good thing about a shopping center like this one is you can duck inside very quickly and hunker down if you need to, and people certainly do right now. We'll keep an eye on things out here in Norwood. I'm live. Julie O'Neill will send it back to you. Bye.